Where the Florida Fish and Wildlife has confirmed an alligator bit a man at an Orange County Park. This happened last night at Barnett Park off East Colonial Drive. That's not far from the fairgrounds. Trappers are out there right now searching for that alligator. News 6 reporter Mark Lehman joins us now live. And Mark, do we know what led up to this alligator encounter? Well, at this point, FWC says it appears that the gator was possibly protecting a nest when uh, that gator bit the man here uh, yesterday evening. This area is where it happened. You can see FWC off in the distance. A trapper is there as well. Uh, this morning, that man is recovering from his injuries. Meanwhile, again, workers are trying to track down that gator in an effort to make sure no one else gets hurt. Now, this is what things have looked like out here this morning since just after sunrise. FWC says it was around 7 Thursday evening when a man was playing frisbee golf and his disc landed close to the water. That evidently was also close to a gator nest. The man went to retrieved the disc and was bitten in the leg. His injuries were non-life-threatening, but FWC says they're still taking this very seriously. We're, in FWC, we're not here to place blame, but we, this is something that we take very seriously. We can't allow uh, wildlife to do that to humans, and we're trying to reduce that human-alligator uh, conflict. So. Now, FWC says tracking down the gator may be difficult because of the thick brush, but even so, they say the trapper will remain out here until that gator is caught. As we come back out here live, here's another look at the effort that's continuing this morning. As for the park here, Barnett Park is remaining open while the search is underway. FWC is just urging everyone to use extreme caution whenever they're near a shoreline like this.